All right, Z, it's uh, TGIF. It's Friday, lemur update time. But first things first, we gotta find a bunch of bamboo to redo the lemur cages. And it's getting harder to find them now because it's coming into winter, so they're not growing. But we've got so much around, I know we can get it. It's just gonna be a little bit of work, Z. So let's get to it. All right, we got all the bamboo for the cages. Hey, what? The Mexican West Coast laid eggs in the water here. What? That's what I mean, that's what it looks like. There's two. Rattlesnakes don't lay eggs. Well, I don't know what this is, man. Oh my goodness. Was that like pre-development then? That's uh, basically the egg follicle. What happens is live bearers, they have eggs, but they're inside them. Yeah, and they, they develop inside, and then they have live birth. Okay. So... Well, I guess since she hasn't been she with She ovulated, her, but... No male rattlesnake. Right. That is crazy. You're like, uh, the female West Coast laid <laughs> eggs. I'm like, Chris? <laughs> well, I, mean, I, I mean, I know there's a lot of snakes that do live birth. Those just look like eggs. I was like, wait a second. Yeah, those, they basically are. I mean, Z, you want to fry them up and have them for breakfast? I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically what it is, is a... Okay. unfertilized egg that developed and she gave you know I always say snakes are like chickens and everything they'll lay eggs regardless regardless but if they're fertile or not and females usually reabsorb them but she passed them yeah there's a couple more but those already broke down way too far yeah yeah that's well in the spring in probably another month Probably January, actually. We'll throw the male in with her. Okay. And with the other female. We'll throw all three of them together. Then you have a little ball. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Since we got one male, two females, we'll throw him with both females and see what happens. That'd be pretty cool. See if we get babies next summer. It'll be neat. That would be cool. That is a cool find, though. Mm. And it is, they resemble, they look yeah. like a snake egg. They do, but it's just gelatinous. Yeah, un undeveloped. There you go. You got to see something really cool. I bet you guys didn't know that rattlesnakes are all live bearers. They don't lay eggs. So those little packets you see in the gift shops and everything. Rattlesnake eggs. <laughs> it just can't happen. Keep them cool or else. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That is super cool. All right, Z, let's get back to work here. Okay. We got all this bamboo cut. We got to put it in cages. So, fun, fun, fun. Z, this is really cool today. We're going to make it a jungle. Yep. We got a ton of it. That's all going in the big cage. Is that the last of it? Uh, I think there's like two more pieces. Holy smokes, they're going to love this. This is crazy I wish Louie liked it and Zabu they just don't Mort there's no reason to come up after my hand you're insane nobody's messing with you hi baby oh you guys are going to love this you guys are going to have so much fun uh, we can put those, those two in here. Make it nice and thick for them. Let's open this cage. Okay. Let's get the uh, old bamboo out. Out with the old, in with the new. Mm -hmm. You got little hitchhikers here. Yeah, I know. Old. 
you gotta spray all these locks. time you guys are going to have fun. All right, Z. Pull those out. Let's get the new stuff in here. I feel like a uh, interior decorator. In a way, I guess I am. All right, give me the biggest stalks, the longest ones. First. Okay, we we'll go up and over with this. This one, this one's basically a short one. So we'll take it over here. Is this a long one? I think so. Gonna be hard to see in here, Z. Yeah. But you know what? They're gonna love it. Oh, this is a good one too, right up here. They're gonna have so much fun in here. Are these long or? They're pretty long. Got there, big ones. Yeah. That one right there. These two are pretty good. Cool. Two 
This is cool. It's looking like a jungle in here. These are the last two that long ones. Those are the last two. These two right here? Yep. And then we got short ones? Yep. Oh, this is so cool. This is true definition of welcome to the jungle. They are going to love this. Right, this goes in a big pipe. So let's see, we'll take. Yeah, I think they're going to love this. What do you think? Yeah, I think they're, they're going to like it. Last two. Last two, those got to go in this one. Bar pipe. This is pretty cool. Yeah. This is really cool, actually. And one more. Where can I put it? Uh, behind the tree. I got the one behind the tree. No, like in between the two by four. No, because you need a pipe. Okay. But I can't put it right here. Nice and thick over there. Holy smokes. They're in a canopy here, Z. Yeah, I see that. You gotta be careful though with this. Mm -hmm. So you don't get splinters. You gotta figure out how to get this one.
That's pretty cool. They got all kinds of branches in here. Mm -hmm. Guys, where do you see this? This is incredible. They're all sitting up in there. All right. Do Mort's cage and then we'll get them some figs. It's gonna be hard to see them all. They are so camouflaged in here, Z. Should I lock it or just dump it? Just do the bolt locks. Okay. Look, they're coming out going, what the heck? This is probably the last week we can do this though, Z. Yeah. Because we want as much sun to get in as possible. In the summer, we want the shade in there. But in the winter, we want the sun in there to warm them up. All right, let's do Mort's cage next. Okay. All right, Z, be careful, Mort. He wants you. Uh, I tricked him. Let's go, Mark. All right, everybody's in. Z, give me the plate. Ready? Go. You can't just say ready, go. Well, that's usually what you say. Yeah, give me like a little countdown or something. So. I, we have no time to count down. All right, let me see. Take this out of here. I'm gonna try to do this without getting eaten by more. the last two? Uh, yeah. There's yeah, no so more? We have the two little ones. Okay, good. Some right there. That gives them some there. They still got their log to walk across. And everybody's happy. Come on out, Mort. Mort's the first one out, huh? Yep. I 
bark. See this? See this? All right, go. Calm out, I'm just so. Well, it's more. I love more. You just misunderstood. Uh -huh. uh, you want hugs? You want hugs? Come here. See, he's not as crazy when everyone else is in the box. Well, there's Mama. She's out eating leaves already. This is so cool. Look at this cage over here, Z. They're just going crazy. They are camouflaged. Almost, them. They are so, you got one up on the four by four, you can't even see. Who is that? He knows Julian. Julian's right here on the two by fours. He loves the two by fours. There's Nala. Yeah, I think there's another one up there. That's the mama of the twins over there. Up on the four by four. Oh, never mind. No, they're all, yeah, she's the only one up there. Chris. Look at this. I think this is the best it's ever looked. I, even though I say that every time. I want to say this is like well, second or third. Like that Madagascar looking son of a gun there. <laughs> I want to say this is second or third. That's pretty, yeah, that's that's up there on the scale of awesome because there's a lot of leaf leafage. I of think we've done not. something a little bit better in the past, but yeah. I don't know because the trees we put in this time yeah. are cooler. I mean, yeah. Zoe is right though, because you know, since I wasn't really a part of this one, so this one. <laughs> oh, you, know? uh, you cut the trees. That's true. I did cut the trees. And you know, I was I was worried about those low branches. We're going to hit our legs in it, mm -hmm. but because I put that two by four in up top. It's less likely for you to knock right. the shim. Yeah. Yeah, because you're not gonna go past that two by four. Yeah, I mean if you are then you're kinda You're coming to the side of it, <laughs> so you're not gonna hit your shim. But look at that. That that lemur's just loving that right Oh, they there. are going they well, love this. What we should do is get uh, another oak cut off. Um, you have like stumps and crap around here. Yeah. Just cut one off like round and then screw it to the top of it so it, it's like they're sitting on top of a log instead of two by fours. Oh on there? But they like the two by four. Do they? Okay. Yeah, because see they they spread their oh, they legs can... across it and they can hold the two by fours. I was gonna put the planks and an end piece on each one, but then I saw how much they were using this okay. like this, so I didn't want to change it. It's because the way their hands are, they can grab that two by four. That makes more sense. Okay. You know, but I did take the sander, I sanded all the edges, I sanded all the sides and backside and ends, and I rounded the ends like you did on the logs. Nice. And it looks, it looks beautiful. And I tested it with my hands, just running my hands everywhere on it, so I could see if I could get any splinters and nothing. It was, so it was smooth as a baby's behind. Behind behind. Behind high. high, high. Be high, high. Hey Z, if you get a chance, can you catch me a lizard, please? I'll try. Please. You should be able to catch him today. It's kind of... It hasn't uh, been if I find time. one, that's the thing. I've seen like 20 since we were cutting, but if you would have told us earlier, I could have grabbed like 10 of them. I need one now. I All need right. one now. All right, we'll go look <laughs> for a lizard. First, I'm going to feed these guys some figs. Now, are you going to feed them or are you going to eat their food? A little bit of both. A little bit, okay. As long as it's like 50, 50, not yeah, 60, it's, 40. It's more like, it's more like 60 them, 40 me. Oh, okay. It's figs. So, 60, 40. Now, if it were mangoes, 60, 40. 70, 30? <laughs> <laughs> 70, 30 sounds a little more realistic. <laughs> oh, boy. Look at us mapping. 
when we're using mass petitioning. Yep. <laughs> we're <Okay>. scientists. <laughs> um, this is going to be the last time we can do the bamboo this winter, though. Yeah. Because the sun's got to get in here. Yeah. You know, it's going to be cold, so we need it open so the sun comes in. Yeah, they need all the warmth during the day they can get. And they, they love really coming help. out and sitting like little Buddhas in the morning facing the sun and following it. They are going to town over here eating these leaves. They like those grape leaves too. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. Even even Mort's enclosure is so yeah. thick and done up. Thick and fleecy. It is neat to see them like that. I can't wait till we build the big 15 foot tall cages. And actually able to plant bamboo in there so we don't have to worry about... We'll plant it right in between the cages so it grows up and some goes in. Oh, okay. But we don't want the whole plant inside. You know, just take over? Yeah. Okay. It'll drown them out. But this is just... oh. We got to find one of the clumper bamboos that they like to eat. Look at, they are in heaven. They are loving that. They are, they got, you know, they're just hanging out. And then you got them sitting on the two by fours, totally utilizing that. And see, that's perfect the way they can sit on them. Yeah. Their tails are off, their butts right there, they can poop and it doesn't go on a board. It's like a, a port of john for lemurs. Yeah. Nice. We should patent that and then sell it to zoos around sell the world. Sell to zoos. The lemur potty. <laughs> lemur potty. Get yours today. Chris, as soon as we sold one, they'd see how we did it and be like, we can build these. Not if we put a patent on it. It'd We'd have to go to zoos all over the world and say, ah. Oh, Cease and desist. I'll take that job. You got to take I'll, that. Yeah, right? That. I'll travel to zoos everywhere in the world. I've been to a lot of zoos in the world. There's a lot of cool zoos around. There's so many cool zoos. That one in Texas is really nice. Brownsville? Yeah. I love Brownsville Zoo. It's not huge, but it's done up so nice. It is. You know, and all the people at Brownsville are so nice. Brownsville Zoo is a great zoo. I like even Disney's uh, Animal Kingdom is pretty cool. Animal Kingdom is done up really nice. You know, they did a good job with that. And there's so many. Oh, Budapest is awesome. Uh, Frankfurt is awesome in Germany. The, oh, you got one too. Oh, Z caught a lizard. <laughs> I do have them. Chris lost the lizard, but then caught I it. I did not. I saw that. You didn't see nothing. It's not on camera. <laughs> <laughs> he lost the lizard, but re-caught it. Well, dang it. Edit that part out. <laughs> the, uh, the zoo in uh, Colorado is really nice. Over by Colorado Springs. Yeah, that, that one's, one's cool. Really nice. uh, San Antonio, Texas has got a really nice zoo. Never been San Diego's beautiful. I used to go to San Diego Zoo a lot when I lived in LA. Cece would be like, we'd have nothing to do on the weekend. He'd go, what do you want to do? Oh, let me guess. Go to the zoo. I'm like, well, it's cool. He went maybe two, three times with me and then he's like, I'll stay home and watch TV, you go. <laughs> I gotta get back in there. All right, Z. Let's go cut up some figs and feed these guys some figs and see how, look at that, look, look. They love the two by fours. Baby wants to come in this troop so bad. Not, yeah, baby does, but he'd get his butt kicked. Mm -hmm. Especially now, most people don't understand lemurs actually go in heat once a year and it's only for one day one day out of the year with the ringtails and 
that's when the males are super crazy because they're trying to breed all the females. Uh, baby's not as at age yet, but he will be. And when he becomes of age, he'll be the same way. Now, I don't know if they've already gone in heat because this enclosure is really hard to judge because Julian, no matter what, if you got food, he's not a jerk. But on the other hand, this group, Mort, he's always a jerk, no matter if you have food or not. And when you have food, he's just greedy. And I think they went in heat because last week, Mort was grabbing the bowl and he was up at the bowl a lot and the females weren't chasing him away. So that's a good sign. They, were, they went in heat that day and then he was eating and breeding. Um, oh, are you eating some oak leaves? Oak leaves are really good for him as well because they actually help warm them. And then we always give them pumpkin and we give them the pump, pureed pumpkin that helps warm them. Look at baby. Going to town on that little branch. <laughs> Can you see her, Z? Mm -hmm. She's like choo, 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 choo. I can't wait. Now we were supposed to get um, Jupiter today, but she called and said tomorrow. So we'll get Jupiter tomorrow. And then we're gonna keep Jupiter in the office with Zabu for about a week and our house. And then we'll put them, that way we can introduce them together and they got the whole office or the whole uh, back room in the house to play and mm -hmm. get to know each other. Then we'll put them out in the cage together. You know, because that way it's no one's pre-established home. So hopefully, fingers crossed, they get along great and all is beautiful in the world. All right, Z. Let's go cut up some figs. Okay. All right, Z, come on in. Welcome to the jungle. We got fun and games. You want one? <laughs> you want a, a date or a fig? She's like, I'll have a date, thank you. Oh, really? This has got to be Julian. You're just like Mort, you know? You're just like Mort. Would you like a fig that time? Here. Oh, Nala, you got one? All the clicking going on. There you go. And all the lip smacking. You want a date? Now it likes Julian. I'm right here. You're as bad as Mort, buddy. Hi. But I can pet you. Oh, you want one too? Here you go. Baby, what are you doing over here? We're going to come over there. Here, have one. Julian, you are such a... <laughs> He's like, stop petting me. There, how's that? Oh, you picked the date. Easy there, young lady. Nala, you want 
a fig. Look at those huge, do you see those canines, Z? Oh. Let's see if we can get a picture of these canines. No, the lips hit the... People don't believe how big their teeth actually are. The canines, they, the fangs. Here, you want this? That's yummy, huh? Ooh, look at that. Can you see the canines? You can see the tips of them. Here, Julian. No, Julian, you lost your spot. You got huge canines, Julian. Here, Nala. I mean, you can see the tips so. of... Oh, look at it. Look at the canines on Nala. Ooh, wow, look at it. See him? They love the figs and dates. Can you kind of always see Julian because his the tips of his are always down. So, uh, they always stick out. Yeah. Dang those! Oh, there's a good shot of the canines. They're huge. Those would do some serious damage to you. I've seen what they do to other lemurs, like to Louie. But Louie's all better now. And we have to, when we put Zabu and his uh, girlfriend down, what? Just don't bite into my finger. Here, I'll grab, yes, I'm grabbing you one. Julian, did you really just take that from her? Here, baby. There you go, sweet. Oh, you wanna, you wanna date. Listen, I'm too old for you. You can't have a date. Ha, ha, ha. You guys are picking all the dates out of here. I gotta save some for more. Well, they can have the figs, then I guess. Here, you want that? The dates must be like candy. They got the sticky. Big. Okay, I see you're licking it, licking it, licking it. I just saw the little comb tongue on that one. Here. What are you clicking about? I'm right here. here. This cage is really cool, Z. Mm -hmm. It's got a lot of a lot of foliage in it. But like I said, this will be the last time this year we do this. Yeah. Because it's going to start to get really cold. And then we got the heaters on their night boxes, but mm -hmm. they got to be able to come out and get sun. Here, baby. You want that? You want that? Hi. Okay, here. You lick. How much is left for Mort's cage? There's a lot left for Mort cage, but it's all, most all figs. Okay. That's okay. They'll, they love the figs too. Okay. And if we don't give them a date, they won't know that there's dates. Mm -hmm. So. Because these guys won't talk. <laughs> yeah.
they're not talking. This one, Julian just flipped a bunch of figs mm -hmm. to find a date on the bottom. Here. Julian, look. As long as you got food, you can pet them. You guys are nothing like Zabu. Zabu loves pets. Okay, I, I can feel you staring at me. Julian's flipping through looking for a date. Is this like Tinder, Julian? You're swiping left, swiping right. Oh, he found one. I think he found the last date. I'm sorry. He took it. Don't look at me like that. I didn't take it. I didn't eat any yet. Julian, there's no more dates. They're all figs. What is it? Swipe left, you keep it, or... I, I don't know. I don't even know. That's my thumb. Don't bite that. Here. Oh, you'll take it from my hand... But because options, that's why there are, there are no more options. No, because out of all the figs, oh, she just wants a date, but mm -hmm. there's no more dates, honey. And you just want anything. such fat, happy lemurs. Mm -hmm. Look at those bellies. Want like this? I wasn't... I think the rest should go to Mort. That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She said I agree. Maybe they ate half the bowl. Yeah, they, well, they ate all the dates. Mm -hmm. You're sitting over there so patiently waiting. Look, I got these three stooges lined up over here. No more dates. All you got are figs. You want a fig, Nala? So, yeah, I'll take one of those. All right. Everybody's chomping away. We should scoop up some of their poop and put it in a pot mm -hmm. and it'll probably sprout. Maybe. Fig trees. Maybe. Because that germ, their bellies will germinate the se uh, seeds in here. Now, Julian is like, okay, I looked for myself. There's only figs left. No more dates. We're coming. We're coming. Hi, Z. You want to feed that group or? Sure. 
<laughs> that sounded hesitant. Yeah. All right, I'll do it. All right, we'll cut this up for Chris for to feed the Louie. And where's I hear crazy running around. Yeah, he's, he's running. Come on. Zabu! Hi, Zabu. Hey, Zabu, come here. He's got, he's got your stuff. Zabu, look what I got. Look what I got. Come on. You actually can come up now. Go on. Go on. You can go up. It's like slippery. He goes, usually you're yelling at me to get down. <laughs> Z, get out of my way. I mean, he did, he did slap the camera. <laughs> He's like, this is a trick. There's something going on. I'm not getting yelled at. <laughs> you want some? Zob? He's like, I'm chewing. Look at these hands. They're so cool. You want that? You want fig or date? He's like, no date. It's weird. Some days they, they want the figs. Some days they want the uh, dates. Look at the back foot. He's like, you guys are up to something. Zabu, come here. Scratch the butt. Scratch the butt. You're such a good boy. Zabu, you are the best lemur in the whole wide world. He's like, no, that's not a date. I want a date. Come on. You want down? Whoa. You want to go run? Crazy boy. All right, Chris, we got a bunch cut up for you to go feed Louie. All right. And and then who knows what else we'll get into. I guess you'll just have to uh, watch more videos and figure it out. Zabu, what are you doing? I'm still chewing. You're such a good boy. Alright, here's this. Come on, Zab. He's like, let me see that camera. Give me that camera. I'm a better cameraman than you. Give me that. <laughs> Zia, I think he's after your job. Yeah. Like, you take it. I mean, it's not the, not the first time. See, he's so funny when he wants you to rub his head. Yeah. And scratch his head. He pulls your hand and buries his head in your palm. Yes. He's like, oh yeah, that's the spot. All right, Zob, I got to put you up for a little bit. And then we'll come back up here and play with you. All right? We gotta go feed Louie. Look at those feet. They're so cool. Look at that. Were you just flea biting my hand? You are so crazy. All right, Zeke's going out with Chris and now 
Okay. Alright, Chris, let's go feed your buddy. Alrighty. Hey, Louie. Got something for you, bud. Go on in, Chris. Do you have the keys? Uh, no, I don't have mine. They're in the car? Probably? Yeah, they're in the car. Right. Louie's like, wait, come back. Louie, we're not giving you any bamboo because you're in a shady area and it's winter, buddy. And you don't like to eat it anyways, but. Hi, Louie. Hi, Louie. Hi. Go see what your buddy's got for you. He's like, treats? He's so picky. Hey, you want this one instead? He's like, no, I want back scratches. Huh? Well, here, how about I put it out here for you? You want to grab the one you want instead? He's like, no, I want right. back scratches. I can do that. <laughs> I can do that. He goes, food, I get food anytime I want it. I need back scratches. The good. most spoiled lemur ever. Well, besides Zabu. Yeah, I think Zabu's got to be. He's got a close second, though. He is so loving that. Look at that. He's like, I got my person. Chris, you're a slave to the lemur. He's like, all right, I'm arching my back. Now I mean, get my back. Look at his eyes. Like, I know. He closes them. <laughs> he squints them. He's like, oh, heaven. Louis, you are so fat. <laughs> Too. He's got his winter coat. He's yeah, nice and fluffy. Hi, Louie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Louie. Don't look over there. Yeah, don't look over there. Z's don't over look. there. Look. He's like. Who's driving that car? Don't, What's going on? It's nobody. Don't come Louie! Oh, you're gonna give us your butt? <laughs> He's like, yeah, let me hold on to, look at that. Oh, <laughs> oh. See, great guys, now he expects you to rub his back too. You get to virtually do it. Yeah. <laughs> Virtual lemur pants. Look how thick his fur is, that winter coat. Yeah. Huh. Oh, are you liking that, Louie? Louie! He's like, yeah, right there. Right there, that's the spot. Oh my goodness. Right there. <laughs> He's like, all right, your turn, Chris. <laughs> you want to jump? Come on. Come on. No? You're not feeling it today? What do you want to do? You want to sit down? He's like, sit your butt down. You want to sit down? Uh-oh. Ah. Uh-oh. You see the keys. You can't have the keys, buddy. Uh-oh. He saw your keys. You can't have them. 
Chris, that's what he wants. He's he he's going back to you. Hey, go get those for me. We got to get him some of those, you know, those little tyke key set? Yeah, the plastic one. I just don't know if he'd get the same joy out of the plastic ones. We could try it and see if he would enjoy them. I'm just scared he'll chew them. And... Yeah, because that's what he likes to do. He likes to, like, kind of chew on them a little bit and uh, um, lick them. Yeah. I think he likes to taste the food metal. That's what I think it is. It's it's got to be that. That's you know it's on a. Oh, buddy. Plus, his original mommy used to get him to stop misbehaving with keys. Yeah. That's why he says it's such a fascination with him. Every time she'd be, he'd be getting in trouble, she'd take out the keys and wig, shake them. And then he would just uh, stop everything and go for the keys. Yeah, he loves keys. All right. Well, Louie, we got a lot of stuff to accomplish yet today. We'll come back and see you later on, buddy. Watch this, Chris. What is that, Louie? Go get him, <laughs> <laughs> <Go get> him Louie. <laughs> he loves his keys. Louie's like, give me those. Louie, you can't eat metal. If you take them, you ain't getting them back. He's crazy. He loves his keys. Yeah, I don't think he'd like the plastic keys no. the same. They're not, they don't have the same jingle. They don't have the same taste. Yeah, it's the metal. It, it's right because they're cold. Yeah. And Okay, excuse me, sir. You, uh, Sir, you cannot eat keys. You would think they're bananas or something. Yeah. Louie. <laughs> All right. Can I have those? Thank you. <laughs> He's like. He's got the taste of the metal on his fingers. He's insane. Louie, you are truly crazy, buddy. All right. We're going. Who's here, Louis? Is that Z? Oh my goodness. He's, do you see that? Louis so loves the keys so much he wasn't even paying attention to Z. But you guys, there you have it. TGIF, Lemur Update Friday. We had a lot of fun today. Uh, still a lot more to get done, so we gotta go. You guys take care, get swamped, share your passion, and uh, random act of kindness, that's it. And make sure you hit that notification bell. That way when we post a video, you'll get a notification and you can check it out. So you guys, love ya, see ya, bye.